This is math unit four. Let's learn what comes after a decimal point and what comes before a decimal point. Let's go. What place is the ones in? <coughs> what place is the two in? Before the decimal. And what place is the three in? Before the decimal. Now, after the decimal point. What comes, what is the two right after the decimal point? What is the two after that two? And what is the two after that two? Now you know what comes before a decimal point and after a decimal point. This is Pete Lanza, signing out. <laughs> this is math unit four. How do you add and subtract decimals? One thing that you have to, have to remember is to go to left to the right, and you also have to line up your decimals. Remember that. That is very important. Line up your decimals. Okay, let's do a question. What's 7.72 plus 7.25? Think about it. Think about it. And the answer is... 14.97. Remember, line up your decimals. Let's quiz you now. What should you always remember to? You always should remember to line up your decimals. And you should also go from right to left. Next, we will be interviewing a very smart person named Peter Lenza. For your personal safety, please give a warm welcome to Pete Lanza. What's the most important thing you need to do? Line up your decimals. Yes. What's another very important thing? Go from right to left. Yes. Good. Thank you, Peter. Yep. Have a nice day. Okay, did you hear Peter? He's very wise. He was listening. He is completely right, and he's not wrong in any way. Listen to Peter. Listen to Peter. Who said that?